Hello again from my car. It's Mara from Mindfully Crocheted. Today I wanted to do a short product review with you. Um, I picked up a product at Natural Grocers and, and my hands have been kind of dry from all the crochet I've been doing lately. And so I wanted to try it out and see how it feels. Um, what drew me to this product is called, it is called Badger Balm for hardworking hands. It's USDA organic. And again, what drew me to this product was that they are cruelty free, it's gluten free, and it's made in the USA. The back of it says it's made in Gilsum, New Hampshire, made in the USA from thoughtfully sourced global components certified organic and certified gluten-free. Also on the inside of their label, I don't want to tear the label, but it has a nice little um, caption on, or you know, caption on the back. It says, we are on a quest to help create a healthier world and taking responsibility for our carbon footprint is a critical step in this journey. That's why our beautiful, post and beam manufacturing facility is run entirely on solar power. Each tin of the balm you receive is filled with nourishing and organic ingredients and lovingly made using clean renewable energy drawn from the sun. Enjoy. So I love the fact that it's a sustainable product and that is made from organic ingredients and they use solar power in their facility. I can't I can't go on. <laughs> it's great. I'm going to just give it a smell. It does. It smells a little waxy. I'll read the ingredients in a minute. This is what it looks like on the inside of the tin. It doesn't really have a fragrance to it, which is good. Um, because some people do have sensitivities to that. The ingredients are Olea Europea, which is olive fruit oil. Sarah Alba, which is beeswax, Rachinus communis, castor seed oil, aloe barbadensis, which is aloe leaf extract, Galtheria procumbens, which is wintergreen leaf oil, and the it has extra virgin olive oil certified organic. that again and that's what the tin looks like all right I'm gonna give it a try it's smooth to the touch um, and look at my hands <laughs> they are pretty dry do this one before I have any product on it you can see the dryness in my fingers all right I think this is definitely a product that you have to put a layer on, see how it goes, put another layer on. Since it's so full, I can actually run it over my hands. When you do a lot of crocheting and you're touching a lot of fibers, your hands definitely dry out. <laughs> Got to get my thumb and my four fingers. I think this is probably comparable to the um, working hands. Um, can't remember the name of that brand. Sorry, hard working hands. <laughs> Comes in like a neon green and yellow container. When you are putting all your love and your time and feeling into a crochet project or another project, you want your hands to be soft and smooth. You got to treat them nice because they're doing, um, they're doing the hard work for you, bringing out your creativity through the form of fiber. 
I actually really like the, it's almost like honeycomb smell. I'm pretty sure when I got these, when I got this at Natural Grocers, they did have one that had um, a little bit of fragrance to it. I'll have to double check on that. But um, I, uh, I decided to get the the basic one. This is, um, I forgot to mention that it's 0.75 ounce. Well, after a couple applications, I think I got the majority of dryness. I got it soaked in. I'm just going to do a little bit more. My hands definitely look less dry now. You can feel that there's product on there, but it doesn't feel so heavy that, um, or oily feeling. It's, I think because my hands were dry, it really did absorb in. <clears throat> Um, but I can definitely feel it on there. I just, it doesn't feel heavy, like a heavy lotion or oily. Um, boy, my hands are so dry. <laughs> I can't believe it. But I have been doing a lot of crochet. Um, still trying to work on this blanket. I am on my final skein, I think, of width. And then I have one skein for the border. But um, anyway... So there you have it, Badger Balm. Once again, soothes and softens rough, dry hands and skin. Apply as needed are the directions on the back. Okay, well, I hope you enjoyed this little review. Um, I am sure you can go on to their website. It says that they are on Facebook. <coughs> Pardon me. <clears throat> oh, Facebook, Instagram. Twitter. So anyway, look them up. It is WS Badger Company Inc. Again, not paid promotion. I bought this with my own money, just kind of found it on my own while looking around natural grocers. But if you try it out, I hope you like it. Let me know what you think. If you've tried this already, leave some information about what you thought about it in the comments below. Thanks for watching Mindfully Crocheted. As always, please take care and be kind. <laughs>